Hi, welcome to my next video and today I decided to make a review of an app which is called Swipad and the reason why I decided to do it is because for the last couple of years it's a very popular Galaxy S6 Edge and Galaxy S7 Edge and people just wondering how to get this similar experience from the Edge screen on their normal smartphones so this app can give you same experience or maybe even better so let's get there and in the following time I'm just gonna show you on the live screen how I using the app uh, actually how you can set it up and get the best of it so let's get there all right so after you download the app uh, swipe it which is actually for free with additional in-app purchases uh, just click on open and here you will see all the options what you can set up to get the experience uh, similar like it's on a Galaxy S6 Edge or a Galaxy S7 Edge uh, you can actually um, only download from the add-ons which is paid option more space uh, the more spaces for this price so it's actually just optional so now um, I would just go through the app with you so you can watch where I click what I do to get the feel like it's on, on this uh, Samsung Davises but I think uh, you know from my experience uh, you will get maybe a little bit better experience than it's on Galaxy S7 Edge or S6 Edge because uh, Swipe Ad will allow you to launch uh, the app immediately without any additional click you will just swipe it from the side or from the point you choose and then you will just actually release uh, your finger on the app you actually like to launch. So let's get to the option pads. Here you're gonna be able to just make a new pad. Uh, so let's uh, create new pad. Um, I will just uh, type uh, name apps for me make it a, yeah we can do it like that so then I will click on apps for me and here you will see the options with empty spaces to put there the apps uh, there is one one nice thing uh, if you will just use some of the spaces uh, on the screen just you know just for example this this kind of spaces uh, you can actually hide the rest of it so you will just get a ni nice look a nice feel from from the app so let's fill up uh, some of the spaces here on the left side so just to get an idea how the app really working you just click on it you can select uh, application shortcut widgets portal groups keypad so let's uh, start just with applications and there you know what what I using most um, yeah I can put our calculator so let's wait so calculator is there here I will choose some another app I will do it just r really fast And basically that's it I just press the back button and now what I gonna do is um, one thing uh, when I have uh, apps for me I will just click on it again yeah I see that uh, I have actually choose just a couple spaces when you click actually on the empty space you will see all the options over here and down here you will see clear cancel or hide so you will just simply click on hide and it will disappear hide hide and the thing is actually in the app here you can't see immediately which 
field is hidden so what you can do you can you can check it you have here the hotspots this is the another option what you need so when you click on it you see uh, all the options where you can actually set up your hotspot for launching swipe pad so here i choose uh, the left edge lower half and i will choose apps for me that was the swipe pad with uh, our, my selected apps all right and from now when i will just swipe it you will see the apps which are over here uh, the thing is uh, that i actually hide some of the fields so here you can just check which fields are hidden now what i will do i will just uh, speed up the video so you can watch it uh, much more faster how i set up uh, the swipe pad to get the real feel which i really looking forward to get from the app all right so let's get into it Now we get uh, the experience, uh, what we're looking forward. Um, let's uh, nail it a little bit. So I will just press uh, and move myself over here and just check, look and feel. Uh, the nice thing actually about this app, what I really like is that you can select your own icon pack which is your favorite for your, you know to match your time in your in your smartphone to match your launcher style what you are actually using right now another thing is what i really like is uh, the tem so when i click on tem you can uh, buy or you can download for free some of the graphic designs for the selection of the app so what you see actually around your around your finger what I like uh, is the shade. I bought this one because uh, when you just launch the app from, from the side, you see some kind of light around your finger. Yeah, and then you can just select the app and you just release it. What I will actually show you later. First one, what I actually bought was uh, the radar. I can show you, I will just simply switch it, select it. And now when I just release it from the side, you see that is a different animation around my around my finger. So yeah, this is really nice and uh, yeah, I really like it. I have to say. Here you have actually as an option to change the wallpaper, or if you don't like uh, have a wallpaper, you can just uh, simply change uh, the background transparency. When I will launch uh, the app, you see that it's actually now it's totally black. So I will just change the transparency. For example, to 50%, click on OK, and then you can see that the background is just visible. It's again up to you, but what what I using? Uh, I using around like 30%. So it's uh, really nice that you can see, you know, icons and it's everything really nice and visible. If you don't remember, for example, the apps uh, or you don't recognize them. By, by just the icon you can as well uh, select uh, mm -hmm. the label position yeah now when I will launch the apps you will see as well the labels and then it is a haptic feedback when I will launch the app it will just uh, vibrate or you know you can you can set up as well the sound yeah and so on um, what actually what I don't like I don't like uh, to have uh, in my status bar many many notifications because after that I can see the really important what I really looking forward to see so now actually what I gonna do I will just uh, go back to my home screen and here you know the nice thing is that you can actually launch the swipe pad from any place in your smartphone so basically if I am you know on home screen I will just slide from the from the side where is um, my hotspot and then actually I can launch any app by just releasing on that place my finger. So let's just 
here is it on the calculator and it gets me just that straight away what is really really nice by my experience or by my opinion the swipe pad it's a uh, little bit better than the experience uh, on the galaxy s7 edge or galaxy s6 edge because then you need to actually by the swipe open the edge panel and then you need to click desired app you know by two moves you can you can launch the app but here you can just uh, launch the app by swipe and releasing yeah actually what what i using if i will show you my swipe pad which is down here below you know i will uh, swipe my finger from the button so here is my setup of my apps what i using a lot it's a really comfortable thing that i just you know swipe it from the bottom and i just go home you know like uh, to the home screen because uh, i'm not really fan of uh, pressing uh, the hardware button what is not for me not really comfortable so yeah this is basically just easy way how, how to get home from any place in the smartphone so yeah i think uh, now it's uh, really all from me about this app so i hope you enjoyed this review and you will give me some comment below to my channel and um, you know actually i'm really curious if you as well like my reviews of uh, of the apps uh, in the landscape mode i thought it can be really interesting for you to get it like uh, on full screen experience uh, for your smartphone so if you prefer to have it in landscape just uh, let me know down actually in the comments and i can do it in for next time uh, by two versions so we, you can decide if you want to watch it uh, in landscape or portrait mode so take care and see you in another video i'll be happy if you can press the subscribe to get my latest news latest videos from my life and yeah let's get in touch by the youtube again bye